What's going on everybody? Bones here with Cajun Our New Barbecue. Hope you're doing fine. Y'all know I'm making it. Trying to beat this heat, people. Got a 30 feet around pool. Got to get the water right though. Right now it's a little cloudy. I don't know what's up. Like, it's clean and, and everything. I can see the bottom, but it's a little cloudy. I just don't feel like driving 30 miles away to go get the water tested. With this gas price situation, I know to y'all it might be whatever, but right now it's 419 where I'm at. Y'all comment below how much gas prices is. Where y'all at? Tell me what, what the gas price is. Go ahead. You know, 419 for regular. Diesel is 540, I think it was when I passed by the, the station. Crazy. But anyway. Today is part two of the Meat Stick. Whoop, nope, this is the Thermal Pro versus the Meat Stick X. Was going to do rotisserie chicken, but we already know the Meat Stick's going to win that round because it's a wireless thermometer. Duh! So, not going to go ahead and do that. Today, we're going to go ahead and put the chicken. We're going to season it up real good and do the chicken on the pit boss. Put probe in on one side, probe in on the other side, and go ahead and check it out. I'm going to flip the chicken every 30 minutes so that way it's got equal time on both sides of the grill and see what the temperature does that way. Let's go ahead and get started, people. All right, we're going to go ahead and begin prepping this bird. I've already patted it dry, let it hang out in the fridge for a couple hours, let the skin kind of dry out. We're going to go ahead and spray it down with some canola oil. This will help brown that skin. Now we're going to go ahead and throw on some Saints and Sinners Sweet Heat. It's got ancho chili powder in there. Salt, pepper, garlic, some onion powder. It's got beautiful color. We're going to throw some of this inside the cavity too. After we get this bird all prepped and ready, we're going to go ahead and get the grill set up. There we go. Today we're using the Pit Boss Classic. We're going to turn, open it up, turn it on, turn it to smoke. Let all that nasty white smoke at the beginning pour out of it. While we're waiting for that to happen, we're going to sip on a New Orleans Presidente on steroids. Look for that video in the future. Cheers, everybody. Now the white smoke is exited, go ahead and shut the grill top down. Turn it up to 350 degrees. Yeah. All right, now it's time to go ahead and get the Thermopro one set up. We've got it turned on. It's currently 90 degrees out here. Go ahead and put it in the breast. Go ahead have your app pulled up already. Go to poultry. We're looking for 165 in the breast. Go ahead and set it. There we go. Now, let's go to the meat stick one. Go to the meat stick app. Don't need tips and tricks. Okay, it has the meat stick pulled up. We're going to go to smoke. 
and I go to poultry, and I go to whole chicken, target ambient temp, we'll set it for 350 if I can get my fat thumb to work right. Sending it to the meat stick now. Start cooking. Alright, there we go. Let's go ahead and now take it off the charger base. And stick it into the breast. Now remember, you got to put it all the way in to the ceramic part. Alright, we're about a half an hour in. Want to take a quick look at our temps. The Thermal Pro side is reading 129 and the meat stick side is reading at 117 so yeah let's go ahead and see what switching them around is going to do there we go all right, gonna give you all a quick update. Chicken's been on for about an hour now. They have evened out on temp. Like the fact that the Meat Sick app has alerted me each time that the pit boss has gone above the target temp for 350 degrees. So I like that fact about it. So we're going to get ready to pull the chicken in a minute. Alright. Let's go ahead and slice into this bird and see what we got. This side here is the Thermopro side. This side here is the Meat Stick X side. All right, let's go up for that taste test now. First up, Thermopro. Very moist, juicy, liking it very much. Now we go after the Meat Stick X. Again, moist, juicy, flavorful. Gotta go with it. It's a tie on chicken, on cooking it. But overall performance, I'm going with the Meat Stick X on this one because I do like the fact that one, when I'm resting everything, like one, the chicken was just pouring out the juices on meat on the uh, Meat Stick X side and not so much on the Thumber Pro side. Then you go to the app, the Meat Stick X app. It was clocking how long we were running and doing the chicken. 
Thermo Pro didn't have that in their setting. Then you had where the, uh, the Meat Stick X also told you that there was a spike of the grill going above the set temperature range that we set. I like that factor too. I didn't have to come and check it on my own. It told me that. I like that. So I, on chicken with the pit boss, I'm going with the Meat Stick X. So, so far, Meat Stick X is two for two. Next up, is chuck roast. Now they're going to be on the same roast. I'm not doing two chuck roast. That's too much for me to deal with. Um, I don't want to have two, eat two chuck roast. So we're going to go with one chuck roast, two thermometers. I'm going to see what the outcome is. Stay tuned. Thank y'all for watching. If you're liking what I do, you know what to do.